Acclaimed American poet Henry Wadsworth once said, music is the universal language of mankind. And so when you're nodding your head or tapping your feet to one beat or another, be it jazz or rumba or gangatone, it means you are connected to a beautiful worldwide musical cosmos to which we all happily belong. <laughs> But then, there's trouble in paradise. A new notorious band has arrived, and their name, quite the mouthful, Orchestra Malmis Disam Propaganda. Yes, you got that right. Orchestra Malmis Disam Propaganda. Now the downside with this particular band, comprising of malinformation on the drums, Misinformation on the bass. Disinformation on the keys. Ampliganda on the decks. And propaganda on the sax. Is that unlike what Jamaican reggae legend Bob Marley once said, that the good thing about music is that when it hits you, you feel no pain. The ballads churned out by this particular ensemble do make you feel pain when they hit you. And no, you don't feel pain because that the music is somber or it's a dirge. You feel pain because, as soothing and as serenading as the music is, it hypnotizes you. And it leads you into a self-destructive realm. A state in which you harm yourself and harm others. Call it harm? disguised as pleasure. The music shows up on your timelines. You scan it, enjoy it even. Then you press forward, retweet, like, or comment. And before you know it, the damage is done. One person, then another, and then another one. They all get drawn in by the disco lights and pulsating beats, oblivious of the imminent danger posed by the poisoned musical chalice. You keep raising the volume for yourself and for others. Boom. Twa. Boom. Twa. Boom. Twa. And then boom. It all blows up in your face. But eh, do you really know Orchestra Malmis de some propaganda? <laughs> 